See, like, that sounds... That sounds good. Coming off the skin.
to do is when you begin to crunch it, you have to just crunch it, crunch it, crunch it. And then you just have to let it unfold, unerupted, like this. so beautiful. I'm going to do it again. Wow. What a beautiful delicacy that I have right in front of my eyes for 730 calories. Basically, no money at all. This is how you survive. You eat it. And then you play with the wrapper to help you go to sleep. Sleep, 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 sleep. This is what it's all about. This is what life is for. Not about family or money or love. It's all about ramen, baby. Sensational. The wine glass has a very, 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 very unique sound.
first thing I should have done. Wow. Dude, that's why I love holes. Because holes, it's like... them and you can also open them and like close them and you can like manipulate the sounds that's why i love like asmr with like holes and lids that's that's actually the reason why i love the mendo's container and now i just discovered that apparently wine glasses can have some wacky wacky hole sounds There's another trigger that I really like. I think it's called Ocarina. I might be saying that wrong, but it makes like kind of like similar sounds like this. There was this guy that would make these really good, I'm pretty sure it was Ocarina or something like that, but it was his ASMR. His name was Nicholas Productions or Nicholas ASMR, and he would be making some of the most fire ASMR beats ever. And like, I don't even know what happened to that guy. I, I think he still uploads, but I'm not sure. But like, a lot of ASMR artists that I used to watch are just like not really as prevalent now. Some of them still are. But it's like I see like a lot of these newer ASMR YouTubers and
like that sounded pretty good. sound good when I just
thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for listening in.